Alright guys, so we're starting off this little video with my bag here. It's going to be a little two part series about the stuff I'm taking to the cabin with me. Uh, this is just the bag, that's my backpack that I take all my like gear in gear. Uh, my poles and my tackle box will be done. I'll probably record that video tomorrow because I have to go shopping. So uh, we're going to start right here with this bag. Front pocket, pretty simple. I carry two bandanas. One's a, like a face shield bandana type thing. Uh, and it's like a stretchier material. I got it for free. Works wonders. I guess I'll lay all the items kind of out. Alright, next up we have this small pouch here. <coughs> ah, excuse me, I have a bit of a cough. Polaroid sunglasses. Highly recommend these when fishing because they do two purposes. One, you can see fish a lot better under the surface. And two, it protects your eyes in case a bat cast hits you. Uh, then I have a pair of headphones. It's pretty self-explanatory. They play music. That's everything in that pouch. Alright. Three small containers labeled nasty. Uh, this is for looking and taking pictures of micro species I catch uh, when micro fishing. Or uh, just something interesting in my minnow trap and to hold bait. Uh, they're really useful. I advise most people take them with them. This right here is the I believe it's the tad pulled by Popeels. It's a vintager, vintage model of the Popeels Pocket Fisherman. It is like my hiking pole because it's very compact. Uh, you know, pretty pretty self-explanatory. We're gonna be doing some hiking hopefully, so I'm gonna take this in case I find any pools of uh, water in the creeks. We reach our first knife, a uh, wild boar, a little switchblade or whatever you call these spring assists. That's kind of like one of my beater knives. But yeah, little uh, little pocket knife. Uh, this is a bag with all my GoPro gear and camera accessories, as like batteries for my big camera, uh, a miniature tripod, extra SD cards, a GoPro, lens cleaner, everything that I could possibly need for uh, my camera and my GoPro is in there. This is a practice pad for drums because someone that's going with me plays a lot of drums so I figure I'd keep him entertained. Alright. Then we have batteries. I carry lots of batteries for my flashlights and cameras. There's actually more in here but I don't want to pull them all out uh, because they're kind of like in their own like pouch in there. Alright. Two more knives. Pocket razor blade. Really useful. They're like $3 at hardware stores. This is a Shrade. I believe it's the yeah it's the uh 304s it's a bigger more beefy pocket knife it's kind of my working knife really like this one uh, and that is all for that pouch then we have my other camera bag this is the bag for the big camera this is where the big camera would reside would be in its protective case and then the iPod that I use for some like footage near the water because it's more resilient. This, those two little things stay in there. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Allergies are pretty rough this time of year. Uh, another knife. I look like Jeffrey Dahmer, I know. It's a Survivor. I don't know what model. Uh, it came in the Bud K video that I did. It came in that mystery bag. A little kind of a cheaper but, uh, belt knife. I think they retail for like $10. Uh, I'm going to be lending that to a friend while we're out there. My belt knife. The Frost Cutlery Master Skinner. One of my favorite belt knives. Very hefty. Made with a full tang rubber handle. This thing can get some work done. I think they retail for about $43. A, another pair of headphones. A very cheap pair. A saw. Uh, a camp saw, or well, I don't know what you'd really call these. They're a little like it's a little hand saw, so by Black Legion. Another thing from that Bud K video. I'm not gonna unravel it right now. That's one of those little saws you use for like getting smaller, like uh, like smaller sized branches cut down for firewood. My Black Widow slingshot. I am taking the arrow rest, but I don't think I'll use arrows, but I might sling six of it for fun. 
I like taking that with me most places. A small pill bottle full of BBs, and let me tell you guys, a little life hack for anyone that runs slingshots a lot. These are perfect for holding your ammo because they're from Walmart. You can crack it open like this and have the child safety seal on it, pour BBs into the top like this, and it screws back in without the child safety seal. So that your BBs are still capped, but you can use it as a bowl to hold them so you can shoot. Really useful. And, you know, anytime you get sick, you get one of these things, so. And there's only one more pouch left uh, with two items in it. Mini baseball bat, a little club. I don't even know why I have it. I bought it kind of for fun. And then a pair of drumsticks. Yeah, that's about everything. I believe that, yep, that is everything in the bag. Uh, yep, that's it all. See ya.